I'm in the greenhouse. Got quite a few plants in here. Nothing like I had last year. I just didn't particularly want to mess with selling a bunch of them this year because I'm doing so many other things. But, supposed to get down to about 32, 33 tonight. So, I got the heat. I got the heat out here. So anyway, uh, and something I do every time when I'm going to heat. Look at those. Those are tomatillas. They've got blooms on them. My first year to raise tomatillas in my solo cups. Got blooms on them. They need to be out in the yard now. That gum I need this weather to co cooperate. Anyway, when I <clears throat> when I do, um, it's going to be windy out here. Sorry about that. When I do light up the fire in here, I also put a tarp on it. There is, uh, <clears throat> now it's still daylight, it's about five o'clock, but uh, there's just something about covering it with a, a tarp makes it a whole lot easier to heat. Of course, I'll have to take that tarp off in the morning, whatever. But uh, anyway, covering it up with a tarp. And you know what, that little old window vent, uh, greenhouse vent opener, whatever it's called, that I told y'all about, many of y'all have bought. Um, that sucker's still working. This is four years. That sucker closed it up because it's cold. It's about 45 out here right now. That's cold to me. Real cold for this time of year. We're supposed to get down 32, 33, something like that in the morning. So I got a nappy looking old tarp on it. I'll come out here probably 10, 11 o'clock whenever the temp starts dipping down. And light the fire, leave it all night. I just barely crack it open where it's got a flame. And uh, just enough flame that I think's not gonna go out. Uh, wind won't blow it out or something. You know, maybe half inch of flame sticking up. And it doesn't seem to use very much. I, I, this about be my, I've already done it twice and, and just barely has moved the gauge on the little old tank. Um, There. You can see the gauge barely has mute moved and I've done it overnight twice. So uh, this little turkey fryer is a um, a great heat source for your greenhouse, so you might want to try that. In fact, I'll just put a link to one underneath the video.